Let me start off this vlog by saying I was not going to vlog today just because it's going to be a very boring day <laughs> for me anyway because I'm just going to be going out running errands getting things for the house and whatnot there's just like little bits and pieces that I need to get done today so that's what today is going to be and I knew I wanted to vlog this week but I wasn't going to start today I was going to start tomorrow and Monday because today is Sunday the 25th I'm pretty sure. So yes, we're starting the vlog off today. I'm actually going to Bunnings, which if you're not from Australia, you wouldn't know what it is. It's basically just like a gigantic hardware store. Everything you need is there. So I'm going to head over there, see what I can find. There's also a plant that I have been chasing that I really, really, really want to get. If you have me on Snap, you might have seen me post it a couple of weeks ago, but that was before I'd moved. And I went back to go and get it the other day and it was gone. So I'm on the hunt for it. Hopefully I can find it. I need to put this away before I forget. Um, I just finished mopping the floors. Now that the house is all clean, I feel like I can get started with like all the little loose ends that I need to tie up and then I'll be content. Everything will be settled. And then I can finally get into a routine because I feel like that is what I need. I need a routine. And don't get me wrong, I like change. I'm all for change, but I need structure as well. Check out how shiny my car is right now. I washed it yesterday and I didn't have a hose fitting for the um, hose in this place. So I need to go buy one of those as well. So I had to do this all by hand, like fill up a bucket of water, pour it on top, Filipino style, I swear. I just changed over the light bulb so that it's a white light now because before it was like a warm yellow light and that is no bueno when it comes to filming so I changed it to white. Right now I'm just moving all of these boxes that are here. I don't know if I'm going to have time to unpack them and put them into the Alex drawers because believe it or not I still have not unpacked my makeup yet. And I haven't even set up like a place to do my makeup. I've just been doing it over the bathroom sink. But yeah, like I was saying, I'm just moving all of those boxes to that little corner over there. And then I'm thinking about bringing the um, mom table, like the table that I usually use to do my makeup into this room. I'm just putting it up against this wall just so I have a spot to do my makeup. I guess I could keep it in that other room, but you're going to think this is crazy, but I'm, I just feel like it's silly of me to have one room to, to like film in and a room to do my makeup in like that's so extra so i'm like let's just put it all in one room that can be a spare room but yeah that's the plan for today i'm all hot and sweaty because i've been like running around the house trying to get things done i actually did go to bunnings earlier today so i got light bulbs um a new tv cable because i needed a longer one and i'll show you what i'm doing with that in just a sec and just other bits and pieces that i need for the home so that's why i look like a bit of a sweaty mess right now <laughs> all right guys we have made progress and if you can see the lighting in here is just what it looks so much better with the white light plus i kind of needed it anyway for the purpose of filming so it's just a lot better with the white light when i film videos as you can see like the room is still looking like a mess i actually do prefer warm lighting in the home like in the bedroom i really like the lights to be really warm but in the office and other areas of the house i just want it to be white i don't know that's just me anyways i think i'm going to go ahead and um think about what i want to have for dinner i think i have some tofu in the fridge that i bought the other day yes i like tofu because fun fact i think i've mentioned this before but i used to be vegetarian growing up so i actually really like tofu just like i like soy milk i don't know i'm just cooking some rice at the moment but while i do that i <sighs> i've been trying to do this right so this is my dilemma, right? The PowerPoint, like where you plug in the um, cable for the TV antenna is over there. Of course, my TV is over here. So I've had to run a cable all the way along to that point just so I can watch TV, obviously. But I don't really want the cables on the floor all the time. So I bought another cable today, like a longer one. I think it's longer, but I think it's the same length. I'm not sure. So I just connected the two for now. But my plan is to get this one. And I have like those little um, sticky things. What do you call them? Let me show you. My plan is to get these and kind of mount them all along around the doorway and feed the cable like through them. Just so it's concealed. Because honestly, this right here... This is annoying me. I don't like looking at it and I don't want a bunch of cables running all over my floor constantly. So right now I'm just trying to figure out where I'm going to put these. So this is what they are. They're kind of just like those removable hooks that you stick onto the wall and then when you when you don't want them anymore, like you can just peel them off really easily. So I need to figure out how I'm gonna stick these along to feed the wire 
to the TV. It's little things like that that have been bugging me since I moved in, but um, tonight I think I'm just gonna spend a little bit of time trying to get that sorted, and then that's one thing done off my list, because I have a huge list of things I need to do. Like, I need to hang up that painting still, put away all that crap on the floor over there, just that kind of thing. Like, I just need to get everything put away and sorted and then I'll be content. So <laughs> that is what the plan is for tonight. So I just finished putting up the the clips for this cord. It's annoying me already. Like, let me just show you guys and you're gonna know what I mean. So as you can see, the cable is obviously like running around the window, but you can see it. Like it's so obvious and I'm not a fan of that. And it's definitely because it's black against a white background. So you can see it a little more. Um, easily but uh, I don't know it's just such an eyesore and it's so annoying to look at and I know like other people wouldn't notice it but because I see it all the time I'm just gonna be like oh so I don't know if I should run it along the ground like along the doorway but I just feel like that's so pointless because I'll probably trip over it anyways so I don't know this is this is the perfectionist coming out right now because I am a major perfectionist and shit like this that wouldn't bother anybody else is totally bugging me right now. So that's the current situation with that and I'm gonna have to decide whether I want to keep it that way or run it along the bottom but I don't know. I'm just gonna keep it like that for now see how I feel maybe I'll just get over it and I won't notice it anymore but for now it's all I can look at when I'm in this room like it's just it's right there. Anyways, it is currently 8 p.m. I've just been chilling on the couch. I kind of feel like I want to go out for a drive. I need to go fill up my car with petrol anyway. And I prefer to fill up in the evening just because there's nobody around. And it's just, it's a lot less stressful to pump gas when there's nobody around, let me tell you. So yeah, that's what I'm going to do right now. I'm going to head out, probably get a coffee or something. Just chill. I have a lot on my mind and I just need to chill out and just gather myself. So that's what we're going to do. We're going to go out, we're going to go for a trip and I'm going to bring you guys along with me. Monday the 26th of March today it is currently I think it's like 10 let me have a look it's 10 30 I'm actually about to leave because I'm going to go pick up CJ we're hanging out today I think he said something about he wants me to help him shop for some shoes I don't know I'm not sure but um that is the plan for today but I'm kind of in a hurry because he already told me that he's ready so I'm gonna go and you guys are gonna come along with me Hello. Okay, are you ready to go? I'm waiting for you. My body telling me yes. There's something that I must confess to you. Let's stay together 
You gotta rock and wait in this one. Hey, come on. It's the only way we know how to rock. Hey, you acting kind of shady. Ain't calling me baby. They're the same way. to vlog all the food because <laughs> uh, I was so hungry so yeah I think we're both tired after that that was a feed my camera died I need to get a second battery for real proud of you man if you guys know me, you know I love sangria. Like that's like my weakness. That's probably the only thing I'd like to drink is like sangria, Corona. Actually, no, I'm kidding. There's a lot I like to drink. <laughs> like anything. I do love. I do love good sangria though. You guys, I officially have my internet connected. <laughs> Good morning guys, it is now Wednesday. Yeah, Wednesday. I'm losing track of the days. I swear, but it's Wednesday. Actually, you guys, it really was Tuesday, not Wednesday. Clearly, I cannot keep track of my days, and I already knew that. But, um, yeah, this day was Wednesday, not Tuesday. I mean, Tuesday, not Wednesday. Oh, my goodness. Okay, yep, continuing. And this is currently my situation that I'm staring at. My office. It's looking like a hot mess. I really want to get all of those boxes out of the way today. That's pretty much my makeup, as well as just office decor and stuff which I'm just going to put into storage anyway so I need to sort through those but I did ask on my snapchat whether you guys wanted me to do a separate video showing you guys how I organize my makeup and how I categorize everything and that is what I'm going to be filming today yes I'm going to be filming my first video in the new place other than a vlog because all I've done so far in this place is vlogs and um yeah I'm nervous <laughs> I feel like I don't know how to do this anymore. But that's the plan for today is to get all of those boxes out of the way, finish up this room, tidy it up, and then have it all set and ready to go so that I can finally get back into filming makeup tutorials for you guys. It has been way too long and I honestly just feel like I don't know how to do this anymore. I also need to go out later on to go to the gym to sort out my membership fees, which I am so keen to get back into the gym. I haven't been for like... Oh, probably the week before I started packing was the last time I went and I have been feeling honestly so deprived it's crazy like how different you feel when you don't work out as opposed to when you do not only just for like the health benefits but also like mentally I feel like working out gives me a lot of like mental clarity it just makes me feel a lot less stressed and anxious so I'm so excited to get back into going to the gym like you guys have no idea but first i definitely need to get this room sorted because it's been bugging me all week all right guys it's currently 3 30 in the afternoon and i'm gonna quickly head over to the gym to go and sort this membership thing out i also need to go and pick up cj on the way because our gym tags i've just always had his and i don't know who's i'm using whenever i use it like i just they're on the same keychain if that makes sense so he needs to come with me so that we can figure out who's is who and then I can finally give him back his gym tag because I've had it for way too long. Yo! Hi! How are you? Good, but my legs are sore. Why? From gym? Oh, what did you do today? Uh, 12 rounds, goblet squats, and then overhead um, squats. Damn! Everyone gets hype as to it. Yeah. 
Alrighty, gym tags are sorted. I'm just dropping you home. Yeah. guys it's currently 8 30 in the evening and i've just been sitting here in the living room doing boring adult things like paying bills and just all that kind of boring stuff i've already had dinner clean my kitchen all that like everything is all sorted so now i'm probably just going to chill out and get ready to go to the gym <laughs> you wouldn't think that going to gym like late at night would be part of someone's night routine like i'm just keen to sweat i just need to sweat i need to get on that shit and sweat it out one thing i do need to do while i'm here is set up my apple tv so i can actually have netflix again i'm not one of those people that watches netflix like every single day but it's just nice to have it like in the background sometimes it's like background noise as weird as that sounds so i need to um find the cable for it because i have the little thing here but I don't have the cable, so I've got to look for that. I don't know where I put it. So I just got done wiping my face makeup off and I look like a zombie now. <laughs> but I'm about to head to the gym. I was feeling kind of tired earlier, but to be honest, I just want to go. So I'm about to go put in this work and yeah, I'll be back. Good morning, guys. So as you can see, I'm currently driving. I'm actually running just a little bit late for my orthodontist appointment this morning. It's currently 10 past 10 and I've got to be there by 10.30. So, fingers crossed I make it in time. I don't think I vlogged when I came back from the gym last night. I was that exhausted, but um, gym was really good last night. I had a really good session. I'm sore today, but usually I'm more sore two days after my workout. So like, not the day after, but the day, day after, if that makes sense. So yeah, it felt really good to get back into the gym. I definitely needed it. Like, you guys have no idea how much I was craving going. But anyways, today, I don't really have too much planned. I'm just pretty much going to the orthodontist this morning. I don't know why, but I feel like this vlog is going to be a very boring one because honestly, I've just been all over the place. <laughs> like, I don't know guys, like I love vlogging for you, but when you're not doing much, it's really difficult to like keep it entertaining, you know? So I just got here but I realized that I forgot to put my elastics in and I hope my orthodontist doesn't think that I haven't been wearing them because I have maybe not as like regularly as I should but then I was supposed to put them in before I came to the appointment and I forgot oh all right guys I just got done with my orthodontist appointment everything is all good things are kind of moving slower than they want them to be which sucks because that means like I'm not on track I guess for getting them off in time for those of you who don't know I'm supposed to have my braces on for about two years and I've had them on for just over a year at this point I think like what are we in like a year a year and a month or so something like that things are moving a little slower than they want them to be because I guess my, my teeth they're stubborn <laughs> but instead of like a new set of elastics I had to get um, these metal spikes 
springs put into my mouth. They're essentially just like a spring, like picture like a metal coiled spring and they've connected them between the two gaps in my bottom teeth. So yeah, that is what is happening. So fingers crossed that does the trick and kind of like gets the process moving along quicker. The gaps in my top teeth are actually looking pretty good. Like they are closing quite quickly. And the whole reason as to why the bottoms are slower as opposed to the top, the other not just explained it all to me, but basically the bone in your bottom jaw is much more dense than the bone in your top jaw. So that explains why shit is moving so slow. But um, yeah, I'm just hoping that we can get things going quicker because I love my braces, but I'm excited to get them off as well. I mean, it's a long way to go, but still, I'm excited. Anyways, I am currently heading to the mall. I'm just gonna go and get myself some breakfast, some coffee. I also need to go in, um, stock up on some primer makeup stuff. You know how it is. I'm dying because there's a truck in front of me <laughs> and it has like a massive um, reverse camera. I don't think it's a reverse camera though. I think it's a camera that records like behind it because you know how everybody has those dash cams and you can also get them for the back of your car as well. And this truck in front of me has one on the back of his truck and you would have seen me talking to a camera by myself in a car. I wonder if they watch back that footage often they're probably gonna see that and be like, um, what is she doing? So I just got done hanging this and I don't know, is it straight? It doesn't look straight to me. It looks like it's kind of lopsided. But that's the best I can do for now. I don't know, it doesn't look straight. I measured down from the trim like the ceiling trim cornices whatever you call them and I put them exactly the same but still it looks lopsided I don't know if I'm like being major perfectionist right now or if it is straight or what to me it looks lopsided I don't know let me know what you think all right guys I'm about to start eating some rice which if you don't know that means like I'm gonna boil some rice and I want to know all my Filipinos how do you clean your rice because this is how I do it <laughs> This is the worst way. I remember when I was little and my mum would always make me sarting the rice. Like that was my job in the evenings. And I'd have to like fully get in there and like churn it with my fingers. Because <laughs> she was very adamant about how the rice was cleaned. This is literally how I do it. I just let the pressure of the water do the work for me and then I tip everything out. <laughs> so I just finished dinner and I was going to go to the gym because it's currently 9.30 in the evening. And I was like, yeah, I'll go to the gym, but my mouth hurts so bad, you guys, like so bad. Even eating my food was painful. Just like any pressure that I apply to my teeth right now, it hurts so bad. Like if you've had braces, you know how it feels every time you get an adjustment. And yeah, it's pretty, pretty painful right now. So I think I'm going to give the gym a miss tonight and just chill. Also, while we're on the topic of braces, one question that I always get when I meet people, mainly like obviously in real life, whenever I meet people and they ask me how old I am and I tell them, they're always like, oh wow, but like you have braces. As if like there's a defined age where you're not allowed to get braces anymore. So people always want to know like, why did you wait so long to get braces? Like why didn't you get braces as a kid? And I've probably said this in a video before, but basically the reason why I didn't get braces when I was younger or when I was a teenager is because I couldn't afford it. <laughs> I guess you could say that my parents weren't in like a financial position to spend money on me for braces, which is totally fine, like that's okay. But obviously now I can afford to do that for myself. And yeah, I feel like it makes me appreciate it more because I've heard a lot of stories from friends and whatnot saying that they have had braces, but they've noticed their teeth shifting back because they didn't do the whole aftercare of like wearing your retainer and all that kind of stuff. So I feel like because I'm getting braces at an older age, I appreciate them more. Because I mean, it's all my hard earned money that is going towards them, not my parents. So I feel it, you know, like I got to do the most and make the most of them and make sure that I'm doing everything right. So I'm not wasting my money. So yeah, that is my 
reasoning as to why I am 27 years old with braces. I also get asked a lot like why did you get silver braces and not just Invisalign and let me tell you like up until just before I got these on I was so set on getting Invisalign like I was like there's no way I'm going to have a mouth of metal like I just can't do it not at this age like I I don't want people to judge me whatever but I feel like I got to a point where I was like you know what I couldn't give a damn like what anyone thinks about me naturally I'm one of those people that just doesn't care what people think of them like I'll do whatever and I just don't care what anyone thinks so I was like you know what we're just gonna go with the silver braces if I'm gonna get braces I'm gonna rock that shit and yeah you just have to own it like I know a lot of people say that they're really self-conscious about getting braces and they're scared and they're nervous and they don't know how people are gonna react and they don't want to be teased but to be honest guys like it's at the end of the day they're on your face like they're not bothering anybody and to be honest like no one's gonna be thinking about your braces at the end of the day before they go to sleep like that's the way I think of things if if something is not going to bother anybody else then what's the point of worrying about it you know like it just shouldn't matter you know what other people think of you as long as you are happy and content with yourself that is all that matters and if you aren't happy and content with yourself then that's something you need to work on to get to that point point. and I totally get it everyone goes through that cycle when they're insecure or they're down about certain things but it really is up to you to change that like nobody else can change that except for you and in reality unless you really want to change it it will not change but anyways I could go on about this stuff for a long time like I'm all about that because I feel like I used to be such an insecure person when I was younger and now that I'm older and I can kind of step back and reevaluate everything and see how I was feeling and understand why I was feeling that way I feel like I can give so much advice on that but yeah, I'm just gonna stop now. Otherwise, I could keep going on forever. But anyways, I'm gonna say goodnight to you guys now and I will see you tomorrow. Baby, yes, baby. Yes, baby.